are beginning tonight with a well-known Santa Cruz surf instructor who has spent the last year in jail on multiple charges of child pornography and lewd acts on minors. Well, today, Dylan Greiner changed his plea and was immediately sentenced. Action News reporter Phil Gomez is live in Santa Cruz with tonight's top story. Well, the 39-year-old surf instructor was hoping for a probation from the judge. Instead, he got a three-year state prison sentence for lewd acts he committed against two minors. I never meant to hurt anyone. And I created it for by the time you go. 39-year-old Dylan Griner sought mercy from the court after he changed his not guilty plea to no contest on 25 counts of lewd acts against two teenage girls. Griner secretly video recorded girls changing in his surf school's dressing room. From day one, he has been incredibly remorseful and contrite um, about this situation. There were 40 letters of support for Griner. His two sisters also spoke positively of their brother. Katie Griner saying, we know he made mistakes, bad choices that Dylan has admitted and shown remorse. I think um, trying to get the family to shed some light about what kind of person uh, he is and has been uh, is important. Three letters were also read asking Griner be sent to prison. One of the victim's mothers told the judge her daughter will take a long time to heal and that if Griner was given probation, then he can get away with anything. I was sentenced to the aggravated term of three years in the California Department of Corrections. Bottom line is, yes, they've been significantly impacted, and, you know, they are fortunate that they have a strong network of people that are trying to help them out, including people from our victim advocate office. And I'm truly sorry. Truly sorry. Griner said, I don't know why I threw away all my blessings. People that I care about hate me, and I'll have to live with that for the rest of my life. And I know that what I did was wrong. And I feel horrible. Griner received a three year state prison sentence, but he spent 382 days in the county jail and could get time off for good behavior. He could end up ser serving less than a year in state prison. Aaron? All right, Phil, thank you. Griner must also pay restitution to his victims and must register as a sex offender for the rest of his life. And you can go to KSBW.com to see Griner's full statement in court at today's sentencing. You will find it on our homepage.